Um, can we talk about the King Biggins? Um, yes. It's being reported overnight that um, they've extended his stay at the London Clinic. Initially, he was just booked in for two nights, and there's been some concern that this could be worrying. Well, I think it's uh, the, the, his prostate he's got in for, and it, it's, it's, it's not an easy operation, but also it's quite common now. Uh, thankfully, you know, they can, you, you, they can find out what you've got very easily if you do the tests, which everybody should do the tests. Mm, I've just done it. Absolutely. Good for you. Um, and it, it, it's marvellous. It's easy. It's no problem. And you, once you do, do it, you find out what's happening. Mm. And you can, you can recover well. But he might, you know, he's 76 years old, mm. 75 years old. And so he, you know, it's not an easy time. And, uh, but he's being looked after by Camilla. And he popped in to see Kate because she's in the same hospital. Yes, that's having, quite sweet. They should be next door to each other. They should, <laughs> shouldn't they? It's a nice little suite they should have. But I, I think he's got to take it easy. That's what it is. I mean, I think he's got to take it easy anyway uh, because being king is not an easy job. I mean, you know, they're both uh, in their 70s and they've mm. got to be careful. Well, well Ella's been saying constantly, you've got to slow down. Yeah. You can't count, because he is a bit of a worker. I mean, everyone goes, oh, they're pampered, they're privileged. But it is a, it's a 24 hour, it seven is. days a week job. It, it is. And, and he is a workaholic and he yeah. just doesn't stop. But he's there to serve. He's, he's there, there to serve. serve. But he does. Yeah.